yeah, you said uh, you can't imagine how dating is nowadays. So let me tell you, um, it is all based on, uh, well, first, let, let, since I had this pulled up, what, warrior, rogue, or sorcerer? Warrior. Uh, see, man, we're the same fucking guy. Anyways, anyways, um, so dating. It's it's basically all, because a lot of people don't like to admit this, and it's totally fine. Um, but unfortunately, times are different. And, you know, when I was dating, when I was in my teens, late, late teens, when I met Max's wife, we met like in real life, right? She came into my GameStop and she, her brother was a regular customer. So I got to know her. And, but now you're, it, people hate this shit when I say this, but dating apps, that's like the general, that's the general route now. Now, unless you live in a place like Atlanta, you go downtown, you live in Vegas, that's a little different. But if you're living like any kind of rural area, like those apps are prominent. And now, I don't know about you, but when I was 2017, 2018, I was on these, these apps hard. Um, and I was in real good shape. Like I was a little bit smaller because um, it takes years to get muscle mass, but I was like shredded. And that's what I put on there. I just put my shirtless picture and I put a dumb bio that meant nothing. And I was getting 10, 12 matches per day. Um, so I was hanging out with a girl every day every single day and uh you know just hooking up with girls and i did that for two years um so it was it was like it was over the top so you got a body I, count how many pissed off girls do you have uh, pissed right. off oh shit i don't know it's it, the body counts <laughs> it's easily over 100 but it's because i live in there's a college like three minutes away okay so um you know it was but the, the unfortunate truth which is kind of a I, I feel like a thing that people don't really learn um, is you'll learn that people are way more similar than they are different. And it started getting kind of, it kind of like bummed me out because I would meet yeah. a girl and she would be the exact same as the last girl I just hung out with the same interest, same like vo vocal tone, same jokes. Uh, she liked to watch Netflix and drink wine. That was her interest. And I, now look, there's no shame in that, but dude, I am not, I'm the opposite. I like to build race cars. I love working on engines, transmissions. I love racing these cars. I love making stuff. I love rock music. I play almost every instrument. That's like a normal instrument. Um, I just, I have a lot of things that I love to do. So like when I have a girl that's just what, that's all she does is watch TV. I'm like, it kind of feels like I'm missing out. So I stopped dating for the longest time. Um, and I just started, and that's when I started focusing on YouTube. 2019 is when I deleted the app and, uh, hit YouTube hard. Yeah, uh, but that's what dating's like now. It's you download the app. Ooh, um, sounds like a nightmare. Yeah, it's like the buffet. You pick who you want, and if you are not physically attractive in some way, shape, or form, you will get no matches. As a guy, uh, I've had friends that were not bad looking, but they yep. weren't. They were like a seven, and they got zero matches like a month, and it's unreal. And, and like a seven girl will be busy all the time. Seven dude. Oh. Oh yeah, dude. That's a seven girl can be with any guy she wants. Uh, yeah, like as far as hooking up, a like, seven guy, you, you fucked. Because what is it? What's the number? It's like, oh my god, it's like twenty six percent of men are sexually active. Real quick, this is my alt channel, and my main channel is in danger every day of getting banned as a result of talking with these amazing people very candidly. So please do me a favor and subscribe down below. Helps me out a lot. Get the hell on it, dog on it. Are dating apps like ask like what are you pulling down a year? Do they throw that on there? Well, like I think that would help a seven guy. Oh yeah, dude, that'd be that would be great. No, I mean you could put it in your bio. Not the best Look. way, but I'm just trying to be practical here. Okay? Just put a damn Ferrari in the background of your picture. Man. Okay, okay. <laughs> I don't like what are the dating apps? What are they like? I I've heard like uh, you know. there's oh my god, there's Bumble, there's Tinder, there's Hinge, and the Grinders the gay one. Which I got Grinders the gay one. That that yeah, okay. I got banned on that one. Um, because my friend, some of my mods, like in 2019, made a grinder for me. And then <laughs> every time I would match with somebody, they would be like, hey, subscribe to my YouTube channel for some reason because they thought they were being clever. <laughs> got banned immediately on Grindr. Yep. Um, and then there's there's like OK Cupid. And then there, there's probably ones now, but I haven't been on it in such a long time now. But um, yeah, um, it's all the same thing. It's just you hang out with a girl and you both know what's going to happen. And even especially if the girl says, I'm not into hookups, then you're hooking up. It's, it's some kind of reverse psychology shit. Uh -huh. I don't know. I'm not um, into hookups. You're the only one. Oh, my yeah. God. Yeah. It's like, oh, God. It happened every Band time. Band on grinder. That's, that's so. Uh... 
Uh, J. H. Schwalbach Classic. says X Ray Girl does hey. a show called Poor Choices. Get out of her lane. She does. What is X-ray, that show about? Oh, it's about watching like normal, like fucking Big Brother or Bachelor or some shit like that. <laughs> Stuff I never watch. Uh, and then her and Tugs like are like normie girls who drink wine and get drunk and judge all the boys in the show or whatever fucking oh chicks God. do when they watch that shit. Jesus. I don't fucking know. Oh, I'll jump into the simp cast and they're just talking about like nails and then talking about boys and I'm like I can't watch this. Like, <laughs> I know. I can't just like, can't did, watch it dude. That's, that's all they really fucking talk about. Like, yeah. yeah and, like I can't um, get my wax during the fucking COVID or some shit and yeah. uh, it's like, like what, and it, we're back to this. They have no interest. Damn you women. No. So thank God they got asses on them right. So um who who's on friday night Tide? or no they were he was just on friday night tots last night who is it? oh disparu disparu yeah dude i watched videos of him watching milf manor oh my god what a what a terrible like shit show of a show that it's is it's unbelievable oh my god it it's uh it's it's almost the end <laughs> it makes you think that western civilization is over 